This video demonstrates the power-up and shutdown procedures for Leica SP8 confocal microscope. To power up the system, these numbered switches must be turned on in order. Number one is the excitation light source on the desktop. The switches two through five are under the desktop. When you're switching, Wait one or two seconds between each switch. Number five is the key. And number six is the chiller on the floor under the optical table. As you can see, the microscope is initializing itself. Wait for it to finish. After that, you need to launch LASX software from the computer desktop. The software will take a couple of minutes to load. In the first pop-up window, all the selections should be as shown on the screen for standard confocal imaging. If you're doing resonance scanning or STED, of course, those appropriate radio buttons should be turned on. The Apply Customized User Settings button is always off. Click OK to proceed. There will be another pop-up window about stage initialization. If you're doing any stage experiments such as tiling or mark and find, then you have to press yes. But before pressing yes, you need to tilt the condenser arm back. This prevents any potential collision with the condenser objective while stage is initializing. If you are not doing any stage experiments, then the answer will simply be no. But in this case, let's assume we're doing stage experiment and click yes. This is how stage initialization looks like. Basically, the stage moves around and self-calibrates. During this step, make sure that there is nothing on the stage and there are no obstacles on its way. After this step, software will take some more time to finish loading. When the software loads, the first thing we have to do is to turn on the lasers. And for that, click the configuration tab on top of the LASX software. And from there, click laser config button and turn on 405 and white light lasers only. Then Go back to Acquire tab, and here, from this drop-down menu, select the objective that you need or want to use. In this case, it's the 63x oil objective. At this point, you are ready to load your sample but there is another video for that. Here I briefly mention the shutdown procedure. After you have saved your file and closed the software and cleaned your objective if needed, simply turn off these numbered buttons in reverse order. 